defect Real Madrid title push though, Craig? Uh, well, uh, the one way to look at it is we're going to find out. But I was looking at the fixtures actually up until their, their winter break and they're not too, they're not too bad. Right. They're not playing. I think the, the biggest team they've got to my knowledge is Betis. Uh, so the fixtures are relatively kind because thinking back about what, how is the midfield going to look now, maybe Tony Cross and Luka Modric are going to have to play together again a bit more often, uh, which has been great for them. But if you think about this season, when the two of them played together in, in the big match in the Madrid derby, it, it was a shambles. Uh, and, and they had to make changes. They got completely overrun uh, in the middle of the park and, and Alvaro Morata had a field day. So I, I think there's some thinking to do for, for, uh, for Ancelotti. Maybe Jude Bellingham drops a little bit deeper, but that negates all these goals. And so there's, there's, a, there's a lot to think about. It could, it could affect them big time, but as I say, the one thing that's gone in their favour, they have a couple of Champions League games, but apart from the Betis game, unless I've missed something, there's an Almeria and there's a Mallorca and there's a lot of them, so it sh they should be okay, but you just don't know. So those two old guys are probably going to get called more into action along with Valverde and I say maybe Bellingham in a slightly different role. Uh, but maybe not for the full two months with the old guard for every game, uh, Stevie, because that would be a lot, wouldn't it? Especially with what Craig's saying about El Derby. Yeah, it would. I mean, it's it's just it's just a little another little chunk out of of what Angelotti can do. At the same time, you know, Camavinga right now is probably getting as many games at fullback as he is in the centre of the midfield. And not losing your fullback shouldn't be questioning whether you win the league or not. Yeah, but they had too many at that point. Well, yeah. and now they lost him. And so Mendy's been coming in to play yeah. left back because Frank Alaba Garcia was a nice a bit more versatile, David Alaba. Well, he should be playing left back anyway, if you ask me. He's got some thinking to do, hasn't he? So, Angelo has got some. Yeah, he's got some decisions to make.